Yeah, because it's angled, you should you should you should uh, straighten it to the edge of the table and sit straight. Well, you can straighten it out. I'm not sitting there behind it, so. Okay, Twitch, you're really slow sometimes, Twitch. No, it's just, I set the category and it's not showing up, so it's annoying. Yeah, it doesn't always show up right away. I mean, I, I'm live. I know I'm live. It's just not showing up right away. Anyways, hello, viewers. This is Faye Morgana, and I am playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey again. I am on the Fate, Fate of Atlantis DLC. This is Alethea's Elysium. And, and we're doing this. Dominance is Bliss. And there's three quests here that I'm going to do. I'm going to do this one. Dead Kings and Pretty Things. So I need to go and find the Spartan Warrior. Hmm, it's supposed to be there somewhere, so let's head off and do that. Uh, which direction this way? Uh, yeah, I think I need my horsey. And he's <coughs> under the map again. Auto riding is so cool in this game. Looks like he's up there. Okay. Teleport. Okay. And Oh, I thought this was supposed to be my house later. of my daughter. So something did survive that day. Oh, How dear. do you have this? Mirini, she's my mother. I'm here because I need your help. I need you to fight. 
I have found peace here. Why would I fight? Well, I was wondering about this house of the bloodline here. I was like, it's her house. I was like, oh, okay. All my life, I was told of my grandfather. The king who spat in the face of the gods and ran his spear through anyone who threatened the freedom of his people. Now I'm the one fighting for freedom, and I'm asking my grandfather for help. We'll need to use the terrain to our advantage. So you'll fight with us? Not until you fight me. You say you're Marini's <laughs> daughter. I want to see how she trained you. I don't think he's gonna die anyway. Let's just run again. Put shots. Grandfather, man. This is what old fool wants her to. could have used you at Thermopylae. You could have used a lot of people at Thermopylae. <laughs> I am glad this spear is in your hands. I will fight with you. You have my word as a Spartan. Thank you, Grandfather. 
<laughs> I could have used you at Thermopylae. And her reply is, you could have used a lot of people at Thermopylae. <laughs> Yeah, but now she's like dropped his health down to half because she beat the crap out of him. <laughs> Shit to be up her granddaddy, man. I was wondering about this house of the bloodline, though. I had a feeling it's related to her. Somehow related to her. <laughs> Alrighty, so on next quest. There's this one here. And I like this level cancel here. Adonis. With its, yeah. Okay, so where is that? That's the phone of these little birds. And it's back over there, so I'm gonna do this one. Time for a ride. You've had your alone time. Tell me what's next. You're keeping up. Good. There's one more place we must weaken Persephone before our time together draws to a close. Her most devoted followers are gathering in a villa near Persephone's embrace. These are the most vile humans in Elysium that serve her every whim and dark desire. Are they under her possession? You might say they're more obsessed than possessed. But if you're thinking you can save these humans, you're sorely mistaken. Persephone's hold on them is too strong. Oh. Um. 
Whatever gets us closer to bringing down Persephone. I'm glad you see reason. So what do you have in mind for Persephone's followers? Poison in their wine should do the trick. Unfortunately, the wolf nearby ate the last of my aconite. Really? You'll need to hunt it and extract the poison from its liver. This symposium shouldn't be too difficult to infiltrate. But once you're there, try to blend in with the other Persephone-obsessed humans. I'll find the poison and infiltrate the symposium. Don't worry. There'll be plenty of time to leave once the humans start drinking. Good luck. That's the poison. Now I've got a symposium to attend. Mm -hmm. Another one. Really? <coughs> I don't know if that was the right decision. Because I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't paying close attention. She wants me to go poison humans now? Really? So what happens if we say something else? I'm just gonna reload. I'm gonna say no. Uh, I'm gonna say no. What happens when I don't pay attention? Alrighty, so, uh, let's do that over here. You've had your alone time. Tell me what's next. You're keeping up. Good. There's one more place we must weaken Persephone before our time together draws to a close. Her most devoted followers are gathering in a villa near Persephone's embrace. These are the most vile humans in Elysium that serve her every whim and dark desire. Are they under her possession? You might say they're more obsessed than possessed. But if you're thinking you can save these humans, you're sorely mistaken. Persephone's hold on them is too strong. Oh. Yeah, okay. Until now, you've been helping humans, not hurting them. I'm helping people who help us, and hurting people who stand in our way. Try to stay with me, won't you? So, what do you have in mind for Persephone's followers? Poison in their wine should do the trick. Unfortunately, the wolf nearby ate the last of my aconite. You'll need to hunt it and extract the poison from its liver. This symposium shouldn't be too difficult to infiltrate. But yeah. once you're there, try to blend in with the other Persephone-obsessed humans. <laughs> I'll find the poison and infiltrate the symposium. Don't worry. 
There'll be plenty of time to leave once the humans start drinking. Good luck. Yep. That's the poison. Now I've got a symposium to attend. Another one. You must take down Persephone's vile, devoted followers as quickly as possible. Alrighty. Um, yeah, where is it? I don't see it. Oh, back over here. <coughs> Alright, fine. Gain access. Not too hard, I don't think. Go here. <coughs> and like she said, she has to go to another symposium. Oh, great. How is it going? Oh, you're going to get used to that big screen, aren't you? If you don't play on the laptop. It looks so tiny. It's fine. Okay. I'm pretty close to Okay. I have a little lamb. Mm. Mm -hmm. I miss having cats. No. Mm. But I'm not ready for new ones. They wouldn't get the proper attention. Because I, I, it wouldn't be fair to them. We wouldn't appreciate them necessarily. And we wouldn't appreciate them for them. Just think of them as replacements. You no. Know. Just wait. Uh, why am I over here instead? Hello, Richard. A fresh face. Is this your first time at a devoted follower symposium? Uh, yes. <coughs> don't look so nervous, friend. Why don't you go meet some people and then we will toast to our new arrivals? Oh. If you're at a loss for words, let other members know whether you think Adonis or Hermes is Persephone's soulmate. We debate that for hours here. <laughs> Poison the wine jars with Aquanet. Uh -huh. <coughs> Tell me, stranger. Who do you think Persephone's soulmate is? The god or the human? Uh, 
Oh dear. Adonis. Persephone adores him. A while ago I would have agreed with you, but... Everyone knows Adonis has been slamming it with some human lately. Persephone deserves <laughs> better. Assuming not her, I turned down him. I turned down Adonis. Praise Persephone, friend. Who spies and kills for Persephone? Is it your group? What? No. Persephone would never want that. I think you're in the wrong place. I should go meet more people. Okay. Persephone sent Adonis the most beautiful boat after he destroyed it another Taluka trying to escape Elysium. <sighs> an argument, friend. We just got word that Persephone is expanding her palace. Should she build into the east or west of Elysium? Um, I don't think it really matters. I think she should expand west. Thank you! If she wants a view of all the Minoan architecture, she must add a wing in the west. I know they're old rumors, but what do you think of the whispers that Ecate seeks to steal Persephone's throne for herself? They look like good friends to me. You know, I completely agree. Persephone needs someone like Ecate by her side supporting her. <laughs> Having a good time. How exclusive is this group? Not at all. We welcome new faces with open arms. Anyone who's willing to discuss Persephone all day long <laughs> can join. Anyone who's willing to discuss Persephone all day long can join. Hmm. That's, that's like so like... Enjoy know. the party. Ecotistico, it's hilarious. I mean, isn't that what everyone wants? Yeah. Somebody just discussing them all day long? <laughs> I'm not sure I'd want that. <laughs> well, you know, you're, you're, people are blocking the way. 
Wait, I can't get through? Which, oh, I can't get through. What the hell? Wow, I really can't go this way. Okay. I guess that was it then. Enjoying the symposium. So, what do Persephone's devoted followers do? For fun. Oh, we discuss the latest events in Persephone's life, plan symposiums, organize monuments in Persephone's honor. So, it's a symposium to plan more symposiums. I should be going. Okay, yeah, that's just funny. Welcome back. I should go meet. Okay, so where's the guy to talk to? Oh, he's back over here. <coughs> How did I walk right by him? I'm ready for the toast. You know, everyone is saying what a great conversationalist you are. So knowledgeable about Persephone. You'll be a perfect fit here. <coughs> <laughs> oh These dear. people really don't seem as corrupt as Ekati made them out to be. Uh -huh. Everyone gather to toast our new members. Oh dear. Okay, that's good. <coughs> Wait, the wine was... Well, I poisoned it. After we welcomed you so warmly, oh you're dear. no friend. Bigger. Guard! Okay. So... Yeah, of course. I'm just gonna put guards on me, though. Oh no, not those guards. Oh, that's bad. Oh my god, that's bad. He's just gonna leave. Why is she up there? I did. I don't know where to go now after escaping. Let's try that.
Hmm. Okay, good. Yeah, I thought I was with some answers there. Quest for Hakate. Alrighty then. We'll go talk to Adonis. Yeah, I to me say it's just present day. Still in the first chapter of this DLC, right? So we've got a ways to go. So next Friday, huh? Try to finish this by next Friday. And eating. level 66 and I forgot to upgrade my my gear uh, whatever there she is how is Leonidas fitting in morale's never been higher scouts are reporting Persephone's influence is weakening across Elysium you're definitely causing havoc out there I won't rest until it's done you know I'm starting to think Elysium isn't such a bad place with you in it 
No, oh, good lord. No, I'm not turning him down, ma'am. Besides, I thought he wanted... This dude, ma'am. It's like, he tells me he wants to leave Persephone for Aphrodite. Now he's hitting on you, and it's like, on your character, and I'm like, what the hell, dude? Yes, if only you weren't in love with Aphrodite, and trying to overthrow the queen, and uh, everyone else wasn't dead, Elysium would be perfect. All I'm saying is you breathe life into this world filled with dead people. Anyhow, we have a bit of a situation. Of course we do. Persephone's guards have cut off supply lines, overtaken hideouts, secrets and locations she couldn't possibly have known without inside help. We suspect there is a spy in our midst. Who? One is a messenger. She was sent with crucial information to one of our camps. When she didn't return, we sent a scout. The entire camp was killed, and she was nowhere to be found. The other is a blacksmith. Soldiers love to gossip while getting their blade sharpened. We think he may have overheard some of our plans. That's a good start. They both have homes in the village. Return to me once you're done. Oh, hi. I need she and Ari. Oh, they, yeah, they probably all would die. <laughs> but I didn't want to kill all the humans. <laughs> How's the uh, Skyrim? Okay. Investigate the homes of the messenger and the blacksmith. Uh huh. And how far are they? Oh, no, not too far. And basically, Cassandra, my character is pretty much a good character. It's just trying to do what's right for everyone. But, considering she's part human... Ah, okay, cool. Definitely the house of a blacksmith. Investigate. Hmm. A list of people Adonis has spent time with. Mine and Persephone's names are on this. Ah, uh, someone definitely spying on her. A note written to Aphrodite. Oh, the blacksmith told her everything. Adonis' escape plans. The rebellion. Hmm. Okay. Let me take some meat over here. Sarah me, no one sarah me. I mean, she is a mercenary. And that's what a mystios is. A mercenary. Hmm? Wait, how do I get in here? <coughs> okay, so now I gotta go investigate the black. Um, who's that? Um, messenger. <coughs> This must be the messenger's house. 
detailed information about one of Adonis's rebel camps. Uh oh. So Persephone knows we've recruited Leonidas. Uh oh. Broken piece from one of the torches of Hypnos I destroyed. Put the drachmi in the bag and no one will get hurt. <laughs> Did you hear that? Hey? <laughs> I have no idea who the spy is. And who's the dirty spy? The messenger or the blacksmith? Both have been spying on you. Both have information that could undo your rebellion. Lousy malakas. My scouts tell me they're on the move. We only have time to dispose of one before they disappear completely. Which is more dangerous to our cause? Um... The blacksmith had a list of people you've spent time with, and a note to Aphrodite outlining your plans for escape. And what about the messenger? She had detailed information about one of your rebel camps, a note to Persephone about Leonidas joining the fight, and a fragment of one of the mind control devices I destroyed. The blacksmith had a list of people you've spent time with, and a note to Aphrodite outlining your plans for escape. And what about the messenger? She had detailed information about one of your rebel camps, a note to Persephone about Leonidas joining the fight, and a fragment of one of the mind control devices I destroyed. The messenger needs to be stopped. Last I heard, she was spotted at a small rebel camp. Okay. Reach the level count. Uh,
Kill the messenger spy. So who's the messenger spy? Wait, what? Oh, <laughs> 
there's a double clown, so we're gonna have to kill all these guys too. <laughs> Nate, look! Or, or you can go look on my stream with this. <laughs> <laughs> they attacked her. I got rid of the spy, and then all of them attacked anyways. I only, I only went to kill the spy, and then all these guys started attacking me. I don't know how. Hey, I noticed there's no bounties in the Elysium, though. Because there's no mercenaries to go kill. Okay, they started attacking me, all of them. Not my fault. It's like a whole row. <laughs> Alright. <coughs> Let's just teleport. I'm gonna talk to her about this. The after source is first. Uh, where's the blacksmith? Oh, yeah, the blacksmith's there. That's good. And then I can go blow up my equipment. All right. The messenger is dead. The camp was ambushed. I did what I could. Any news on the blacksmith? He escaped. If he reports back to Persephone, many lives are in danger. Our next move needs to be swift and deadly. Meet me later at the palace of the Colossi. Mm -hmm. I've acquired a little something that will turn Persephone's paradise upside down. I think I only have one more quest left. I don't understand. Why does he say that and there's no quest? To Aphrodite, my beautiful Aphrodite, everything is going according to plan, my love. We've amassed significant forces at Iapetos' ruins, and I've acquired something that will be devastating to Persephone's Colossi. Soon the queen will be tossed from her throne, and I will be in your arms. Until then, 
and know that I miss you with all my heart. It will take more than all the gods within the world to keep us apart, Adonis. <coughs> okay, Chris, we've discovered one of the rubble camps. It's a destroyed temple nestled between Neopatos' ruins and Adonis' gardens. Meet us there, and we will surround and overwhelm these Malakas. Oh, actually, it's on the end. Malacca Strayosh. <coughs> My queen, our suspicions were confirmed. The fallen king of Sparta has joined the del delinquents in their cause. As always, our forces are ready to serve you, but perhaps you know the perfect person to deal with this king of headaches. Always at your loyal service, Kipris. Uh huh. And so much trade, uh, trade goods here. <coughs> Come on, she got here. Items or something. Why can't I? I'm very confused. Something is being glitchy with my inventory. Things being glitchy. Wait, why can't I destroy these weapons? What the hell is going on? Change on my inventory, it's being glitchy. I don't know why it's being glitchy. Oh, I think I might restart the game. <coughs> this place 
certainly looks busier than the first time I came by. Which is good. Don't start trouble, Mistyos. Welcome, Mistyos. Thanks for looting. Okay, what is going on with my inventory at all? Why can't I get rid of this inventory? Damn it, it's taking up space. Inventory is glitched. I don't understand, but it's glitched. Is okay, this sucks. <coughs> All right, I think I'm gonna be right back, people. I think there's something wrong with my inventory here. Um, I don't know what's wrong. It doesn't, like it doesn't seem that it's full. I don't think it's full. Yeah, something weird just going on in my inventory. I don't think it's full, so anyways, I think I'll have to end the stream until I figure out what's wrong with my inventory. So I'm gonna restart the game. See you in a... See you in a bit, hopefully.